Murder for hire. Stunning new details and testimony in the unsolved murder case of Brittany Stikes. Good evening. I'm Sheree Palello. And thanks for joining us. I'm Mike Darda. Stikes was found shot and killed along a highway in Brown County back in August of 2013. She was 17 weeks pregnant at the time. Based on court documents released today, an eyewitness informant claims that a man was paid $20,000 to kill Brittany. Three days ago, detectives searched this home on Hog Ridge Road in Falmouth, Kentucky. According to the search warrant affidavit, they found and removed 19 items from the home, including 10 cell phones, several letters, a camera, computer tower, four rounds of ammunition, and a gun with the serial number scratched off. WLWT News 5's Emily Wood spoke with Brittany's parents tonight. Em? Mike, Brittany's parents are disappointed and concerned this new information could hurt the case before a grand jury can indict, but they are glad that someone has come forward and they will continue to hold out hope. I cannot imagine the fear that Brittany went through. Married 28 years, Dave and Mary Dotson have spent the last two dedicated to finding justice for their daughter Brittany. I know they've been looking for the gun. They've been looking for other evidence. So, you know, it's a little bit of light at the end of the tunnel. According to Pendleton County court documents, a witness told detectives her ex-boyfriend allegedly murdered a female in Brown County, Ohio. On the night of August 28, 2013, the witness claims they saw a yellow Jeep at a gas station and followed it. The surveillance video is the last video of Brittany and her husband's yellow Jeep the night of her murder. The witness claims the suspect used a police light to pull over the yellow Jeep, then walked up to the yellow Jeep and fired several shots. The worst part about all of this is my daughter, when she lost her life, thought she was being pulled over for a speeding ticket or something. And they murdered my daughter and she didn't know why she died. The Dodsons believe investigators are on the right track and have learned to remain patient. So if I have to wait, the Lord tells me to wait. I guess I have to wait. Now, the suspect listed in those court documents is currently in jail on unrelated drug charges in Owen County, Kentucky. Brown County detectives have not said when or if this case could go to the grand jury. Reporting live tonight, Emily Wood, WLWT News 5. Emily, thanks. Brown County has never named a person of interest or suspect in this case, and no motive has been mentioned in relation to the witness's claim that someone was hired to kill Stikes.